18 million adults in the U.S. experience heartburn every day. Most of the time, heartburn is not a serious health problem, but if it's left untreated, it can result in more serious health issues, such as Barrett's esophagus, a condition caused by chronic inflammation and changes in the lining of the esophagus. It's important to be tested for Barrett's because it can increase your chances of developing esophageal cancer. Dr. Joseph Shami of Gastroenterology Associates of New Jersey, LLC, provides expertise in the treatment of GERD or heartburn. Now when people have reflux, what is happening is the acid is sitting around too long in the esophagus, starting to create a problem. Reflux can manifest in multiple ways. The most common is a burning sensation in the back of the chest, mostly after a meal, sometimes in the middle of the night. But some people uh, do not associate that with acid coming back into the esophagus. If anything, some people will have chest pain and many times this will bring people to the emergency room thinking they're having a cardiac issue. If your GERD symptoms do not respond to treatments or improve, esophageal testing might be required. The quickest thing is to look at the esophagus. Now, uh, a complete endoscopy can be done. Of course, that entails sedation, losing a day of work. Um, most of the time what I'll do is I'll offer my patients who come in um, a transnasal esophagoscopy. That's something that I do right here in the office with local sedation of the nostrils with uh, local anesthetic and the back of the throat. And then we pass this very fine uh, scope through the nose. We look at the esophagus, can tell right away if there is hiatal hernia, suspicious for Barrett's, and, and that will at least start the, the direction of where we want to go next. Barrett's esophagus is on the rise because many people do not properly treat their heartburn. The treatment usually is either a what we call a laparoscopic Nissen fund application um, or some of the newer procedures are a Lynx procedure where a little uh, bracelet of titanium bolts is put in surgically again around the end of the esophagus uh, and more and more now endoscopic anti-reflux procedures are coming on the scene. The highly trained team at Gastroenterology Associates of New Jersey provides customized care and advanced treatments for GERD.